Hey folks, how y'all doing? Welcome back and old man at the Kasari. This is the original air fryer toaster oven. Uh, and the things are also rotisserie too. Uh, I've had a couple of people say, I, I thought you said it was a rotisserie. And, and I know, and I have not used the rotisserie option yet. But today we're gonna do some air fried potatoes on there. Folks, we're gonna, this, we're gonna really take advantage of the capacity of this, of this Kasari air fryer toaster oven. So let, I'll tell you what, let's take a look at the taters, get them prepped and get them in there. All right, there we go. There's taters we're going to use. I love these little petite gold. If you can find these, man, they are awesome. And we're going to be cutting these up and tossing them in just a little bit of olive oil with a little bit of seasoning. And then here's our air fryer rack. And everybody always asks, what's, what's the size, Tom? How, how big is it? How big is it? So it's, it's 12 inches by 12 inches. If you need to know, 12 inches by 12 inches. Let's get those potatoes ready. All right, there's our taters. Uh, everybody, if, what, what was in that bag? That was about one pound of these small golden's here oil i'm using the zangs turf oil folks folks if you can find this stuff uh you know especially stores or some of the local grocery stores might have it but infused uh it's infused with garlic it's really good and then uh, spice things up a little bit how about a little bit of the weber kicking chicken seasoning and uh, yeah it's not just for meat you can put it on taters too and we're just going to give her give them a toss here really simple to do and then uh onto our uh, air fryer she'll go all right, there they are in the air fryer, and here's our controller. You can see we got set at the air fry, 400, and then we just press start. And it goes to our preheat, and then it'll go into the baking mode right after that. If you wanna avoid that, all you gotta, the preheat, all you gotta do is press it again, and there you go. Now it's set to countdown 25 minutes. Give you a couple look-sees as we proceed. Oh, there we go, folks. You can see what the time is. We're about 16 minutes into it. Uh, remember, I didn't do a preheat. Uh, a lot of people ask, does this cook as hot as a regular air fryer, like a 5.8 quart? And, you know, the, the answer is going to be probably no, because there's so much more room here. Plus, you've got this glass door, so it doesn't seal as tight. But I'll tell you what, you can see sizzling there, and she is a cooking. And if you're wondering where the heat is coming from, there's a, you can see the bottom See on the bottom, they're not on, but on top they are. And then there's a fan over there. You can see it, see it right there? And there's a heating element in there also. So that, that's what works when it's on the air fry. So go a little bit more, and then we're gonna turn them and brown them up on the other side. And this is probably gonna take a little longer than 25 minutes. I, I, was, I was expecting that. Uh, but the great thing about it is that you can fit a whole lot on here. This is one pound, there's plenty of room. We could easily probably put two pounds or a pound and a half in there. And what you got there is enough for a nice side for an evening dinner. So give you a couple more look-sees and keep on watching. All right, you can see a little splatter on the window there. This is about 30 minutes. I did flip them. Oh, that's why they look the way they did. Uh, I wanted to see what they were like on the bottom. These two, see these two over here, they, they were flipped the other way. And look at how brown they are on the other side. So I don't even know if you have to flip them in here. I, I don't think you, you would based on where the fan is and it's blowing on top and underneath. And that's why you put it on this middle rack here. But uh, some uh, the smaller ones are done uh, and the bigger ones are really close to being done. So we're gonna go just a couple more minutes and I'll give you a look, see once we plate it up. Oh man, look at, look at that. I tell you what, that was on the Kasari. You know, you saw it. Using the air fryer, air fryer option, that's about 30 minutes, folks. Uh, uh, that's one pound of potatoes right there. Like I said, you could do a whole lot more on there. And look at them. I mean, they're they're hot. So I'm going to break one apart here. Steam coming out of there. They're done to perfection, folks. Uh, nice side. Uh, this air fryer, toaster, oven convection oven. Remember, it even has a rotisserie. It goes around and around and around. I have not tried that out yet. I will at one, some, some point. Keep on watching and I'll show you that. Tom Horseman on YouTube. <laughs> Folks, thumbs up, leave a comment as you do. And I, I, I can't say it enough. Once again, thanks for watching.